Here's what you need to know about concavity. The second derivative tells us how the first derivative or the slopes of f are changing. There are three situations we need to consider. First is if the second derivative is positive, that means the first derivative is increasing or the slopes of f are increasing, which means that f is concave up. The second is if the second derivative is less than zero, that means that the first derivative is decreasing, the slopes of f are going to be decreasing, and f is concave down. The third situation is if the second derivative equals zero, that means that the first derivative is neither increasing nor decreasing, so the slopes of f are remaining constant, and f would be linear. Quick pause. If this is helping, please subscribe right now. I'm pushing hard to reach 1,000 subscribers, and every single one truly counts. When we look at the graphs of f, concave up can occur in an increasing or decreasing manner. If you're concave down, it could also occur in an increasing or decreasing manner. An easy way to remember this is concave up, the graph looks like a cup. Concave down, the graph looks like a frown. So for this function, we're going to determine the intervals of concavity. First thing we need to do is get the second derivative. So the first derivative is, and the second derivative is, then you set the second derivative equal to zero and solve for x. You factor out a 12 and factor the trinomial and then solve each factor for x. You would get x equals two thirds and x equals two. And we use those values to make our sign chart. And we test the value in the second derivative on either side of those values. The second derivative at zero is going to be positive. So that means before two thirds, the graph of f is concave up. The second derivative at one is negative. So that means on the interval two thirds to two, the graph graph is concave down. And finally, the second derivative at three is positive. So the graph of F is going to be concave up on the interval two to infinity. Hope that was helpful to you. Make sure you like this video and subscribe for more.